Hi, I'm Dr. Mukesh Gupta from Lenest, Malad, Mumbai. How do we react to a person who has behaved wrongly to us? And what are the various ways to control our reaction? Even if we don't want to be angry, we somehow just can't control our reaction to people. And how do we manage this behavior of ours? This is the key step in anger management. And this is what we're going to discuss in this video. For those who have missed the earlier videos, we have, just for the sake of convenience, divided the anger into three phases. One, the pre-anger stage. Second, the anger stage. And third, the post-anger phase or the stage. Now, when we talk about the anger phase, we can subdivide it into three processes. First, some trigger which has made us feel angry. Second, our reaction to that trigger, which actually takes us into the cascade of fight or anger where we get into the phase where we keep arguing with people and that's the whole phase of anger so actually the most key stage of our anger is our reaction to the anger meaning this is our emotion which decides us whether we'll go into the cascade of fight or not and this is what we're going to discuss today well let's try to understand that when somebody gives us a trigger or a behavior or an action which we perceive, it is our perception, remember, which we perceive to be wrong or not acceptable to us, we give a reaction, okay? So, what are the various types of reactions that can be give, given? So, first we'll try to understand the types of reaction and then how do we control it. Now, when somebody says something to us which hurts us or which makes us feel bad, we react to that thing. So, in simple words we say, Somebody said negative to us, so that's why I responded in that way. Well, so the responses can be of three major classifications. First is, you'll respond like a mirror. Somebody is thrown a negative emotion, you're throwing back a negative emotion. This is nothing but a compulsive expression of anger or a compulsive expression of, you know, uh, your non-acceptance to the person's negative behavior. So that's first response, that is the mirror response. Second is the sponge response. The sponge response meaning that whatever the somebody is telling you, you're trying to absorb it and not respond back and trying to control yourself. So you're more or less almost suppressing your response to that person and you're not actually responding. So this is actually something which is an amazing behavior, but it has its own impacts. And third, is your response where you're proactively transforming the response from a negative to a positive emotion which i call as magic machine so either you can behave like a mirror or you can behave like a sponge or you can behave like a quintessential magic machine where you are converting and transforming every negative energy into the positive energy so the mirror actually comes because of our problem of contagious anger Meaning somebody is angry with us and we get infected by that anger and we respond back in the anger. It's actually contagious. Or somebody has said something, not out of anger, but just because they don't like it. But we are so infested with the anger emotion that we throw that contagious anger to that person and then that person will respond and you get into the cascade of fight between each other. So this is nothing but the poor uh, acceptance of our uh, uh, anger emotion. So if you don't behave like a mirror, the next option is you behave like a sponge. When you're behaving like a sponge, you're actually absorbing everything and not responding back. If you keep absorbing, 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 and you know it builds up, builds up, one fine day, if you do not have good control on yourself, it is going to explode, what I call a jack-in-the-box phenomena, and you're going to give it back. One fine day, kab tak sunungi mein? Kab tak sunta mein? One fine day, you'll give it back to that. Well, that is also going to take you to the cascade, and again, you'll land up in the fight. But sometimes, we are very, very calm and we are extremely controlled and we let it build up, build up, build up. But remember one thing, over suppression can lead to depression. So if, if the sponge is getting filled up and loaded and if it is not getting evaporated and you're filling up and filling up and welling up and welling up with the negative behavior, negative thoughts about the opposite person, one fine day you will feel depressed because you're not able to express yourself and it is all filling up inside, which is also not a good thing. So you may not actually be fighting with that person, but from inside that suppressed anger is also a bad thing and it is as bad as a disease which will lead to depression. But there's a third type of sponge response where you are super cool sponge. 
whatever is the negative emotion somebody is giving you you have the capability and the ability to absorb it and calm down and dissipate that negative energy from you and it gets evaporated like the water from the sponge and then you feel again ready for come on give me more it's like that rocky balboa telling in you know uh, his opponent that come on hit me i can take anything and that's the final phase of sponge this type of sponges do very well in life because they can absorb everything and yet be happy so this is the sponge response i talked about mirror i talked about sponge but the most ideal thing the utopia of all responses or the re reactions is the magic machine now what is this magic machine magic machine is a transformation machine where whatever negative thought or emotion is coming your way you are converting that into a positive energy think of yourself like an air conditioner as much as the heat would be in the room the air conditioner has a capability to absorb all that heat convert that by its compressor into positive thing that is you know the coolness or the cold air and it throws back only cold air only cold air comes out of you only positive thoughts comes out of your mouth only positive behavior comes out of you you can only do nice and good action and that's the utopia and that's called as magic machine in my parlance so you can react by a compulsive contagious anger of urge to respond in the same way that they are or you can behave like a sponge where you can build it up and one fine day break down and jack in the box phenomena or you can build it up build it up build up build up and suppressed emotion and suppressed anger leading to depression or you can be a very calming person where you'll be able to absorb everything and calm down and let it dissipate and let the negative energy flow out but never give back any negative emotion but the most important the best thing that is is the magic machine remember all of us behave in one way or the other or react in one way or the other depending on our own mood our own state of mind and depending on who the person is against whom we are reacting so if it's your child or your loved one you may want to be nice to them it's your boss you want to be nice to them if somebody whom you want to appease you want to be nice to them so you'll always behave either like a calm down sponge where you're absorbing everything without responding or a magic machine where you're only going to give a positive energy but if it is someone whom you hate or someone whom you really don't like there's always going to be a mirror and you will say how dare that person say this to me i'm not going to take it lying down i'm going to give it back to that person and that's where we keep behaving like a mirror so when you behave like a mirror and the other person is behaving like a mirror it is like a mirror the images are infinity you'll keep on fighting till infinity if you want to bring down and have a calming and a positive behavior in your life you need to move down the level and you have to reach that level where you behave like a magic machine well remember one thing the choice of reaction to the same situation is yours you decide how you want to behave with the person opposite to you and that will decide whether you'll reach into that cascade of tutu meme and argument and fights with the partner or not thank you very much